it's time to read from our favorite book. Yay, story time. I love stories. What's today's story about, Franny? Our story begins underwater in a submarine at the Great Barrier Reef near the coast of Australia. Where we meet up with Olivia, our guide, who knows all about the sea animals who live there. Oh, wow! Look at that fish! And that fish! Oh, and that fish! They're all a part of the Great Barrier Reef. What's the Great Barrier Reef, Franny? The Great Barrier Reef is a wall of coral where lots of sea animals live. It's sort of like an underwater city for all the sea life. I love it! Will we get to see any dolphins today, Olivia? We just might. This is their habitat, where they live. But first, take a look at this little guy. That's a hermit crab. They live in the old snail shells that they find along the reef. When they grow too big for their shell, they try to find a new, bigger one. Like moving into a bigger house. Look, he found a new shell. Welcome to your new home, Mr. Crab. <laughs> what was that? That's an octopus. They like to collect shiny things and arrange them around their home. That's so cool! Does anybody know how many arms an octopus has? Eight! Wow! That's a lot of arms! Do you recognize this sea animal? It's a sea star! That's right! Did you know that instead of breathing through your nose or mouth like we do, a sea star breathes through its feet? Wow, really? That's cool. <laughs> well, well, what are you doing, Frankie? I'm a sea star taking a big breath. <laughs> <laughs> hey, look, it's a dolphin. She's an old friend of ours. We call her Matilda. I love that name. Hi, Matilda. She's a really good swimmer. Where did she go? She went to the surface to take a breath of fresh air because she's a mammal and not a fish. She breathes air through a blowhole in the top of her head. Wow! Well, I'm afraid it's time for us to head back to shore now. Hey, look, Matilda's back. She came back to say goodbye. Goodbye, Matilda. Nice to meet you, Matilda. Thank you for showing us around, Olivia. I always love to talk about our sea friends here in Australia. And thanks for taking us, Dad. That was a great adventure in Australia. That was so much fun. <laughs> I can't wait to hear the next story.